All right, so we want to suppress flashbangs, okay? So there's two different ways to do that. I'm going to give you the first one right here. Let's type in merv cvar unhide all, okay? Enter. This is going to allow us to access a lot of commands that we weren't previously able to access, okay? As you can see, it opens up almost 1,900 commands that we weren't able to access before, which is kind of cool. Okay, so we also want to put an SV cheats one on, okay? Cool. All right, now we can access the mat suppress command, okay? Which is really helpful in allowing us to do a lot of different things. All right, we're going to put in mat suppress space quotation effects forward slash flashbang dot vmt quotations okay cool all right what we're gonna do is we're gonna press the up arrow we're gonna scroll over to the end of flashbang we're just gonna do underscore white okay that's it boom all right let's play this and this flashbang that's about to happen we shouldn't see Cool. All right, so normally, even though uh, Perfecto here turned, you'd still get a little bit of flash on the screen. But as you can see, because we put in those commands, all we saw was the flashbang pop against the train, that little flash against the uh, train's reflective surface, but we didn't get the flashbang effect in Perfecto's point of view, okay? So I'm gonna show you another way. So this way, you actually edit your stream so the flashbang doesn't show on your stream recording, okay? It's sort of like a deep-rooted fix for a flashbang pop. So let's hop over to the console, okay? So as you can see, why don't you go ahead and copy these down before I clear them out, all right? I'm gonna clear them out for uh, clarity's sake. All right, cool. So the other way to do it is to actually edit a base effect stream. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do Merv Streams Add Base Effects, and let's just call it Base, okay? All right, so Merv Streams Print. We now have a stream called Base, great. Now, Base Effect Stream allows you to actually manipulate Counter Strike in a way that you normally wouldn't be able to do if you use Start Movie or Normal Stream. Okay, so this is really important. All right, so now that we added the Base Effect Stream, we're going to put in Merv Streams Edit Base Action Filter Add Effects forward slash Flashbang No Draw. Okay. That's our first command. Action filter basically allows you to draw or not draw textures, materials, and other just overall particle effects that occur in CSGO. And for, in this instance, it's going to be the flashbang. Okay. So our next effect that we're going to no draw is we're going to press up arrow key. Okay. And just like before, we're going to scroll over to flashbang. And we're basically going to hit underscore white. Okay, all right, cool. So let's go back. Actually, let's let's do this. Let's do Merv Streams Preview Base. Okay, and this is gonna allow us to preview our stream so we can see if these effects took place. Okay, so let's go back a couple ticks. So we're at 12, 4,000, okay? So let's go demo, go to tick, 12, uh, let's do 3,500. Okay, now Perfecto is about to throw this flashbang and we are previewing the base stream. Let's see if we see the flashbang. Cool, it looks like it worked, awesome. So it looks like we have managed to find a way to suppress or not draw the, the various flashbang effects that occur on CS. You can do it via stream or you can do it the vanilla way with Matt Suppress, okay? My name is Anthony Perfetto, and today we're going to teach you how to remove smokes from your fuck me sideways. What am I talking about? How's it going, folks? My name is Anthony Perfetto. Maybe I should not slur there. Let's try that again. We just removed all the holiday themed things like chicken hats or chicken hats or uh, chicken hats. I'm sure there's other things. Yeah, that was a terrible take. Let's try that again. Happy holidays. 
Today, I'm going to teach you how to remove flash, flash, flashes, flash grenades, flash grenade, flashes.